guys welcome to a new vlog so I'm not really in the mood to vlog right now but Zama and Melody are in the kitchen making scones for the first time this is their first attempt so I'm just gonna leave you guys with them and I will check back tomorrow knew from the first time I saw ya you were not like the others a cool kind of melody Why don't we just put the sissy pagela? This is Jamoko Kobegaya You found a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah You found a different side of me Like someone pretty need A different side of me, yeah You found a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah Good morning It's 8.30 I woke up at like 7 So my schedule was kind of like out of the window But that's because my period came this morning So that happened so I'm just a little frustrated by that. My schedule went like right out the window. I woke up like the house is on fire. Like girls know, like when you when you start to pray and you sleep, you just wake up like you forgot like the stove on or something in the middle of the night. It's pretty crazy. But I was expecting it anyway. Um, but it kind of sped up like my routine. I didn't stretch. You know me, I'm afraid to aggravate my pains and like get them started too early. I know they're coming, but I don't want to get them started too early. So I'm having breakfast now, ready to go broth. It's like half past eight, I was done. We're like taking a bath and stuff. And then I'm just sitting outside with Sama, getting in some breakfast. So <laughs> I was kind of just telling her how, because I have the worst like pains. I was just telling her how I want to take pain medication like now so I can get in front of it but she said I can't really do that but that would be cool if I could actually take pain medication to get in front of the pain that would be fun and then I just want to show you guys the scones we made yesterday they turned out pretty cute actually for our first attempt I think we did pretty great but then again it was an easy mix kind of thingy but they don't have like we didn't put in any sugar so they don't taste the greatest Mom jeans, so they're supposed to be 
like sitting high waisted like that. But they're like at the back, then there's like this huge gap. And I just don't know like what's supposed to happen here. And then, right, they're like that, right? So that's the first problem. Second problem is that like they're mom jeans, but they're like short at the end. You know what I mean? And then, and then they just don't fit anymore. And then I'm bloated as well because of my period. And I can't put them down here like that. Okay. These just don't fit me anymore. I think I just have to accept it. I can't put them down here, like under my belly, because like if I were to wear them. I can't put them there because it looks like my crotch is all the way to my knees, which is not cute. So I am burning up. It's not supposed to be this difficult to put on jeans. <sighs> what am I gonna wear? I like the top. I'm just wearing like a white top with this little, tiny little at the top. I was gonna wear like a black one, but I don't have a black t-shirt without like any writing on it. Okay guys, so I finally found something that I would that I'm comfortable in. So I'm wearing an oversized t-shirt with like a little crop on the top because I want a little bit of shape. Like I want to look cute but still be very comfortable. So that's what I'm feeling like right now. I almost had a breakdown as long as like I'm just not going. I'm just not doing it. I need new clothes by the way. Anyway, so yesterday I kind of just like hung out and like just rested on someone's bed like for the rest of the day like from four to like basically this morning I was just in bed um because my pains were just really bad yesterday and I've always heard like girls saying that like they have pains in their back but I'm just like what that has never happened to me until yesterday so yesterday I felt that and it was not fun so I kind of just laid in bed for the whole day so if you're a guy, this is where the vlog ends for you because I just want to have a little chit chat about like girly stuff. Do you know what I mean? So um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a like. And if you wish to see more of me, you can totally follow me at nantanamatango29 on Instagram and subscribe so I can see you in my next vlog. I love you for watching and I need you to leave. boys don't suck anyway we love boys we love don't you love boys i love boys um so i just wanted to talk to you guys about my switch so you may have noticed in the vlog that i was busy reading this because i made the switch from this right which is like sanitary pads to this right it was a very scary switch for me because the last time i used last time and the first time that i used tampons was in high school and it just didn't feel good. I remember I was on my way to school and this thing was just like riding up like, no, on my way back from school. It was just like digging in me. I could feel every single bump in the road, which is not good. So I kind of like laid off tampons like after that, but I've always known about them and I always wanted to try them. Ugh, my phone is glitching. Okay, it's fixed. I'm gonna make this quick. So I've kind of always known about them because my oldest sister has used them since she started her period, but I kind of just had that really bad experience. So I was like, nah, it's not for me. You know what I mean? But I think with pads over time, it's just like a little frustrating to actually feel something like down there. Like I don't wanna feel like I'm on my period. I'm already like in pain. So I like the tampon because I'm also very squirmish. Like I'm just like, I don't like I'm I don't like, like seeing blood and like surgeries and stuff like that so it kind of like freaks me out in a way so I'm really I, I like them because it's like inside and it kind of catches everything before it comes out which I mean is just like great and like literally trying to get all this information out before my phone just freaks out so yeah that's what I'm using right now I'm having a really good experience so far, sleeping is a breeze. I sleep like a baby. Usually, like, I have to change my positions. Like, lay on my back, lay on my side, lay on my stomach. You know what I mean? But with a tampon, it's just, like, sleeping. Which is, oh my god, this phone is being a bitch. 
but this is my reality. My phone is just, it's a mess. It's like freaking out. It's on its period too. It's having some period pains. So um, yeah, I'm having a good experience so far. No leakages so far. I feel really dry. I feel really comfortable. I, I feel good. It's like one less thing to worry about. I don't, I don't like the wet feeling and just, like I said, I'm a little squirmish. So let me know your experience if you switch from like the one to the other, how you're enjoying whatever you're using right now, any recommendations for me. I'm using um, Lilacs right now because that's what my sister got me. But what I want to try and do is just like every month just get something different and then kind of just figure out what I like. I think I'm gonna go for Kotex next because I really like the pads so I can only imagine how the um, tampons are. So the Lulets are really good though, I like them. Thank you so much for staying up until this point. If you're a guy and you're still watching this, I mean, at least you know for your girlfriend or your wife or your daughters or anything. Um, so I love you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a like. And if you wish to see more of me, you can totally follow me at Nurtanamazamu29 no on Instagram and subscribe. I feel like my phone's going to glitch. Leave me your experience down below and I will read it and I will talk to you guys on there. I love you so much. I'll see you again soon. Bye.